your girl Bianca welcome back to another video this shirt my friend made it she's so talented so if you want one let me know and I'll hook you up but this is an assumptions video I asked you guys on Instagram and you told me your assumptions now I'm gonna answer them deny them whatever all right let's hop right into so if it. you want to see this look check out my previous video but all right first assumption I thought you were always mean and hated me in middle school <laughs> well in middle school I was mean so I can see why you thought that but hate such a strong word I've never hated anyone so that part is wrong but I love you now and I'm nice now so um, thick. You already know. I thought you were stuck up the first time I met you, but realized you cool as hell. LOL. Um, I've heard that a lot. People think, I mean, I'm not, obviously, but I carry myself a certain way, I guess. Maybe that's why. Or my face, you know, is not the world's most approachable. So, but I am cool. So I'm glad that you think I'm cool now. Literally, you are so sweet. That's so nice <laughs> because honestly, I mean, I'm, I am really sweet, but I have not always shown that I am sweet. So for you to think that, especially since I've known you in high school, that's crazy. You real, you smart, you loyal. All right, that even though you were brought up in church, you struggled with faith at some point. Of course, who has not? Especially when everyone is living like worldly and you're young, you wanna live that life and you don't really wanna do the whole church thing, but once you learn it's more than just the church and it's actual relationship, it's a lot less of a thing to struggle with you still struggle with things <clears throat> but yeah so yes I did at some point for sure I thought you were spoiled <laughs> I mean <sighs> I don't think I'm spoiled right people think I'm spoiled I just think I have done like what my parents told me to do for the most part and when they have the money, they get me things I want. So, no, you're wrong. You don't like people. <laughs> That's not true. I love people actually a lot. You break necks whenever you walk by. You think so? I don't break nobody necks. You like jelly? This is funny. You like jelly on your toast instead of peanut butter or butter. Not only is it funny, but it's actually kind of creepy that that's so true. Because for like all of my life, I hated peanut butter basically. So I would only eat jelly on my toast when I do eat toast. But now I do have some sort of enjoyment for peanut butter. So you're kind of right, kind of wrong. So, it's weird that you know that because you don't even know me that like that. So, mm. you secretly want to eat a burger right now. <laughs> I definitely do not. It was a funny story. The girl trip, we went to Dave and Buster's. As you saw, I got an impossible burger, which is like a vegan substitute for a real burger, but it has heme, which is what gives it the flavor of a real burger. And I don't know what happened, but when I started eating it, it like psyched my mind out because it tasted so much like a real burger. And like I started getting headache and feeling really nauseous. So, mm -mm. I don't miss burgers, <laughs> okay, <laughs> at all. You are a very passionate person. I had to look that up because I want to make sure, like I know it's not something negative, but I want to make sure, you know. 
see. Passion is a feeling of intense enthusiasm towards or compelling desire for someone or something. So, um, I've heard this a lot. So, not just because I've heard it, I believe it, but I do think I'm a very passionate person, especially when I'm really into something or into someone not even like romantically but just in general i'm like really invested and i so i guess passionate yeah you are extremely loyal even when it hurts sis that's how i was raised like even when i wanted to back out of things my parents would be like nope you committed to it you gotta stay with it so it's just I guess created like this tea in me <laughs> so I am really loyal and there has been times where people have not reciprocated that back to me but I've learned that um, that's okay that doesn't mean to change how loyal I am but just don't always expect the same loyalty in return it'll save you some little feelings hurt so yeah <laughs> and someone said you love well <laughs> that is so kind because I don't think I love well like I know like I know I love but I always feel like I can love better so I guess I love well is you're not into relationships right now this is the whole little rant I'm about to do so that is not entirely true or false <laughs> so I have very high standards and not like oh he got to be six feet he got to have six figures he got to have a brand new car or something like that like I have high standards like I need you to like you have to bring something to the table and not just surface level stuff like certain sur certain surface level stuff is like necessary but you need to be like a prayer like warrior i need you to be a great leader i need you to be a man chasing after god's heart i want you to be firm in your faith i want you to be is willing to learn more about yourself about the environment about just life in general and just certain things and I'm I don't even want to say I'm picky because I'm not picky but for I was telling my friend actually how all semester like I was not interested in like any type of flirting any type of little oh hey what's up good morning type of stuff like none of that because I just got to a place was like, all right, when I do get into a relationship, it's gonna be sent from God and that's it. Like we in it for marriage, we in it forever, <laughs> okay? So I'm not trying to play no games. And also I feel like I had to make sure I knew myself. I had to make sure I knew my identity wasn't like Christ. And like now that I believe I know that, the door is like cracked right so it was like shut lock and key like I was not trying to be in nothing no dating no talking no nada but I really feel like I've developed these past like six months and I'm open to the right person I don't just jump into any and everything so it's not entirely true but yeah and I think that was it there was only a couple that were kind of like repetitive which I already answered and so y'all comment below oh y'all see those muscles but y'all comment below what kind of videos videos you want to see I have ideas but I just want to you know make sure I'm still tailoring to my viewers and that's all for this video and yeah I love you guys all I see is blessings, got no 